For today's loadout, I thought it'd be a fun idea to use a different weapon from each iteration of the raid. For the original raid, we have the inaugural address energy pulse rifle. This is an adaptive frame, so it'll be 3 to the head. It has kill clip, outlaw, and some ballistic options. Once you have kill clip active, this thing is an absolute monster. I mean, it's pretty decent when you don't have kill clip, but that really, really sets it apart. The fact that you can chain together reloads and kill clips. For the second iteration of the raid, the Argos fight, you have threat detector, pulse monitor, rapid fire frame on a shotgun. This is adequate, it's okay, it's middle of the pack. So for that reason, if I get a 10 kill streak, I'm gonna pull Legend of Macrius. I feel fully justified in doing so. For the third iteration of the raid, we have the Last of the Legion kinetic sidearm. This has full auto zen moment, reminiscent of the Last Hope. It is a burst sidearm in the kinetic slot. It's unique for that reason and that reason only. Is it great? I'm not sure, but it's unique, and it brings me this unique pairing. Mechaneer's Trick Sleeves, which are probably one of the worst exotics possible, with some Kinetic Boosters, Kinetic Recoil Boosters. Top Tree Arc Strider. What I'm trying to do is shoot a Pulse Burst, switch to this, melee, get my health back, all that jazz with the Hunter. Hopefully this turns out to be a good one. This is a perfect map for using Inaugural Address. It can't beat the Scout Rifles on the right towards B flag, but it'll, it'll do some work. Yeah, that's a lucky grenade. That always happens to me, so I feel bad for him. Let's go work towards B-Flag. They can shoot me in the back, so I gotta jump as low as I can. And I successfully stole shotgun ammo. This is great. Let's go take the jump man back to the C offices. And uh, just see what I ping. See, spirals. Uh, you see the little exclamation point? That means they're under fire. So that means I should start figuring out what's shooting him and how I can help. Now what you'll notice on at least the PC platform is every hunter and his mother is running that stupid dodge to get your health back exotic. So there's almost nothing I can do once I have somebody weak. I can never chase them down. It's suicide just thinking about it. Let's see how I can help. I know they just pulled shotgun ammo. I gotta be wary of that. I have threat detector so I have the heads up of when he is coming here even if I am crouching or if he's crouching. Oh, I couldn't jump over this? That's weird. There we go, first kill clip of the day. Turn around, help teammate. Only 32 damage on him, but luckily teammate has a pulse rifle, or a fusion rifle. Now I turn around, help spiral. I see they just pulled, no, no, they didn't pull power. I thought I saw it disappear. Just an illusion. You can shoot uh, cone grenades, which is why they're very, uh... Well, I'm kind of stuck here. Let's use threat detector. It took away my radar, but I at least have threat detector to tell when somebody's coming. Oh, I thought I got another kill clip. Let's use teammate's shield. Oh, bait it out. Teammate, you don't have to chase it down. I got you. If he thinks he's gonna get me, I got him. Same thing. How many more? Oh no, Graviton Lance almost ended my career. Back it up. Now, on PC, you can normally flick 180 and start sprinting on my controller, which I'm using, by the way. If you notice me making a misplay here and there, I'm not exactly as used to controller as I used to be, but I'm still pretty decent. They'll think twice about that. Let's see here, I really want to use Acreus, so I want this 10 kill streak. So controller has its pros and cons. It really does though. Some people think controller is so powerful that they want to ban it in tournaments. Like, no. It just has its pros and cons. For one of the big pros, and that is using a, uh, a sidearm. A burst sidearm, specifically. Stop you if you fight together? Nothing. Oh, can't chase that down. Careful. I know I'll get lanced out if I'm not careful. I have a super. That's great. I'm going to use that as a panic super. Did he get his health back? He did get his health back. All that dodging to get your health back nonsense. 
Perfect. Oh, there's a 10 kill streak. I got the Acreus. It's over. It's over, enemy team. You have no idea what's about to. Perfect. I will switch on the spot to grab that ammo. One Acreus bullet, man. I'm so excited. I put a burst there to show where I am trying to lure them. <laughs> oh my gosh! <laughs> the shoulder charge knocked me back into the perfect area to hit him with the Acreus. And only because I switched the Acreus and not the other shotgun did that actually kill. Now I'm going to super and take this power ammo out of their hands. Lol, I just took the Acreus and ran. No fucks given. Oh, okay. Oh, mistakes were made. Wait for teammate, now we challenge. Because remember, these hunters get their health back by dodging. Let's break that while I have the opportunity. Yeah, Mechaneer's Trick Sleeves are one of the worst exotics. They definitely need a buff. I don't know what exactly they could do to them, but they need a buff. Oh no, I pelleted him. The thing about Arc Strider is it has deceptively far range on its attacks, so you kind of have to pull it early or you just die or trade. I went for the risky shot and it, it, it didn't pay off. So what more can I say? 2v1, I should be looking for an exit strategy. I see my teammates are across the map. They're gonna get a free shotgun or something. I can beat it if they separate. Perfect, I have a kill clip. Now I can definitely beat it. Just have to watch my spacing. Oh, too late. They never pushed me. I see ones on the sea landing. I have to take my opportunity now. This guy's a Eugene. My exit strategy is an arc bolt. And a kill clip. Peek again, Eugene. I don't care if you're full health. And I still have the outlaw active from the last kill. Dude, this gun is awesome. It really is. I recommend it. Let's see. I see a red ping. He might have a nade. Definitely has a nade. Alright, let's get out. I can definitely make it. I'm ready to use my dodge if I get shot in the back. It's a mode here. See what I see. So just one for now. Eugene wants to push, man. I got him. I'm ready. I got... Okay, there's two of them. I cannot peek. Wait for teammate to make the move. This sidearm's great. Thanks for the Acreus. Oh, I'm about to have so much Acreus. So ready. Please, feed it. And because I am a asshole. Let's go to Marksman's Dodge. Don't show him my Acris. Want to hide it whenever I can. And turn around and fight him. Oh, I really suck with that. Holy shit. I'm still going to make it work. Still going to get a double. Now I still have an Acreus. Don't let him forget. I know that's an enemy uh, lightning nade. Had to use the dodge. See ya. Oh. Pellet shot. Now we wait. I'll peek. I'm not afraid. Apartments with you, team. Perfect. Let's see if I can go snag all this ammo they're about to take. Pay attention to what they grab. Shotgun. Back it up, back it up, back it up, back it up, back it up. It's coming. Oh, he's dead. Teammates got him. Thank you for the Acreus. Can I get him through the wall? Oh, that'd be sick, though. Jump up high. Yeah, he tried to dodge and dodged into the shield. There we go. Get the kill clip. Kill them on spawn. They ain't gonna be ready. Carefully. 
I mean, Graviton Lance should beat me at that range. I did have teammates. I had a lingering kill clip. I used it on the wrong guy. I think that's fine. All things considered to take a trade there. It didn't have to happen, but I really wanted the kill. I'm going to lure him off the map. Ready for this? Oh, oh, good jukes. That was a sick game. I might play some more mini games like that in the future with these live commentaries, like unlocking the Acrius. Well done. Yeah, that was an absolute terror. I'm going to end the episode there. Maybe you learned something. I tried to have fun with this one. I hate that hunter helmet that... When you dodge, you heal. But I'm going to abuse it in a future episode as soon as I grab it. Still haven't done the story mode. But uh, I'll see you in the next episode. Thanks for hanging out in this one.